Hey guys, this is Odron Gaming. This is going to be another Watcher of Realms video. We are back at it, guys, and we are back with the exciting stuff because, well, it's Summons Day. I've been saving for the last two weeks because, well, there wasn't much stuff that was exciting to go over with. There wasn't anything too crazy that kind of like, you know, tried to entice me to pull. But this time around, uh, we do have a guaranteed event, which is, you know, something that's really fun. It is quite high, you know, you're guaranteed at 250 summons to get Falsia, which honestly, she seems pretty amazing. And especially because I have so many Northerners, I would love to have a Northerner fighter as well to my team. Because, <clears throat> like I said, if, if you look at my Northerners, I do have, uh, well, first of all, I have Nocturne. Then I do have, uh, no, wait, he's Esoteric. Let's ignore Shamir. I have Maul, then I have Vortex, Medan, Olag, Mary. I have his soul as well as, as a Lord for the Epic. So, you know, I have a pretty good Lord uh, lineup, not Lord, Northerner lineup. So getting false in there would not be too bad, especially from watching Ivy League Gaming, you know, my wife's video. She seems pretty awesome. So my goal is to go for her. And if I do get her, I think I'm going to stop after that. Like, I'm not really that interested from here. Like, the epics are mad. The legendaries, I, you know, heard a lot about Calypso being good only if you have her A5. So I'm not going to be pulling till I get A5. That's too crazy. My only goal is going to be it's uh, to get her. So the good thing that I see here, it's on for five days. So because it's on for five days, that makes it even better because if you do not have enough this time around, you don't necessarily have to draw, uh, you know, straight go in and buy more shards. You might just be trying to push more content, get some more rewards from other stuff, and you know, you can get close to getting her if you don't get lucky and pull her, pull her early. Because from my understanding, is if I do pull her early before the 250, that's it, the event ends, and you know, that's where I'm gonna stop. But uh, I guess enough talking. Let's see, let's see how my luck goes. So let me see my small there. I don't want to have, you know, my big head going in there. Come on. <clears throat> Come on. Let's see. Let's see. What do we start with? Start with the rare packs, which is, you know, it's kind of normal because it's just a 10 times. There's uh, obviously nothing in the rare so I can think of that I need. I cannot save the copy of anybody that could be interesting. Okay, we get an epic. Let's see. Who's it going to be? I could, I could go for something interesting. Okay, Laurel. Okay, I don't mind. I think she's good for some cheese strategies as well, as far as I'm aware. Plus, I don't mind getting more esoterics. I don't have more uh, esotericists for my faction trial, so I'm going to take anything I can get. So, you know, it's new, I'll take it. Usually when it's new, I'll take it. Or if it's good dupes, I will also take good dupes. So, you know, I would not mind another Demos if I can, but no, he's pretty rare to get. If I'm not going to get Demos, though though this time around i already have five crystal i think or six i can just straight up a5 him so i was waiting on that till i did my pulls maybe i might just keep waiting till this weekend to see if i pull more but you know we're gonna have to see anyway it's all about falsia or, or falkia however you say her name but i'm guessing it's false okay navras i already have a copy of him and i guess i'm just gonna have to awaken him because why not you know always awaken your epics do not feed them Always awaken them unless you have them awakened five. If you have them awakened five, then you can do uh, feed other copies. Okay, Komodo, I'll take it. It makes my Abomination Fusion easier, so I will take a Komodo. I don't think there's any reason for me to keep him because I already have Wrath, I already have Demos, I have Zillid too, so I have plenty of fighters. Plus I have Baron, so I'm, I guess I'm kind of set for the... I think that they're the Nightmare, yep, I'm set for the Nightmare one, so, you know, that's pretty good. But let's keep going, come on. Okay. Let's see, another epic. What's it gonna be? Come on, let's get, can I continue the luck though? That's gonna be an interesting question because this account has been really lucky and the extra A drill definitely shows the luck. I think this is my A4 A drill, so getting close to the A5. That's, you know, that's just awesome. <clears throat> that's just awesome. If you've seen my previous pool, I do have Silas, I have Vierna. I do have a Zillet too. So I do have some amazing ones in there. So yeah, that's what I'm saying about my luck. Okay, Maul. <laughs> I already have an A5 Maul. So I guess he's just gonna have to be fed for the Waken shop because there's nothing I can do with the six one. You know, A5 Maul is, that was done in the first two weeks. Come on, keep going, okay. We're gonna click, fast click through the rare tax. Okay, one more, then we're, we're gonna collect some rewards because I think I'm gonna have another 10 pop by this. Maybe sell some of the rares. Yep, there we go, there we go. So uh, let me collect this over here. Two more. I need one more. I think I have it for my weekly because I haven't collected that one for. I didn't finish that one for weeks because of this, you know, because I did not do a, a ten pop. Okay, two more. I'll take. Okay, I'll take them. I'll take them. 
Okay, let's see. I guess I'm just gonna straight up sell my uh, rares over here because there's no other rares I can think of that I need to keep. Actually, what's this one? Is that one Autumn or Spring? <laughs> I keep confusing them. I know there's another cheese strategy where you want. Okay, I already have a uh, Autumn A5, so I guess, yeah, there's no rares that I actually need to keep, so I can go ahead and sell them, the ones that I have. And uh, now let's continue with the pulls. Let's continue. Let's see. Another still on the good banner. Okay, another temp up. Then we're gonna have to dip into the diamonds. Okay, has to be some. It has to be some rare taxes as well. It's fine. It's fine. Let's see another two. So I'm still gonna need. Okay, I'm gonna grab. I guess another one. That's still. I don't think that's gonna be enough for me to get some other stuff. Let me just collect. You know everything just to make sure. I always want to make sure that. I get all the rewards that I can before I go too hard on some stuff. So, for example, do we have anything here? No, obviously, summons are not going to give us summons, right? That, that kind of makes sense. Only leveling up. Anything here? Dark challenge. Okay, let's collect these ones. Okay, this one. I don't think they're going to give. I have not looked into the Crawling Dark uh, challenge yet. I'm going to have a look at this one later and try it out. But uh, <clears throat> anything I'm missing that I collect my rewards. I'm so like, oh all over the place because you know summons but uh, yeah let's go back to summoning let's go back to summoning let's start dipping into those gems because i have quite a few uh, saved up i did buy a pack when i hit level 50 i bought the level 50 pack because you know it looked too good and i'm like Ugh. i showed you the message like yep yeah, go for it okay light lock another one of those fusions i think he's also part right he's also part of the abomination fusion if i'm not mistaken i guess i could quickly check that uh, no, it's Vortex. Okay, never mind. I know he was one of the ones, but I don't think there's a reason for me to build them. If you guys think there's a reason I should build Lightlock, leave it in the comments below. Keep in mind, I have Vortex, I have uh, Madan, I have uh, uh, Nisande, so, you know, don't see any reason why I should do it. Come on, let's see. Can I hit the Legendary? Come on. Come on, still with Epics. I guess it's... Uh, I'm going deep on this one. I'm going deep on this one. Okay, Vortex. I'll take all the Awakenings I can get for Vortex because... He's my main healer. He's my main healer everywhere, and it's he has an amazing rage. I love that about him. His rage is, uh, range is just insane. He can cover so much ground. Okay, Osiren. I don't know. I don't know about this one. I haven't heard much, but new one. I guess I'll take it. I'll take new ones as well, you know, just to have a look around, play around with them. Still, let's keep going. Come on. Any luck for today? Any luck for... Okay, Legendary, let's see. What's it gonna be? Come on. Come on. Did I get a false here already, or... Or not. Let's see. Come on. Come on. Come on. And, and, and. Let's see. Uh, okay. <clears throat> I heard that he's amazing. He's an amazing mage. So I'm not going to be upset about the Lassier. Plus, uh, he's new. You know? Why would I be upset about the new legendary? I think he's actually pretty amazing. But it, he's, his range seems pretty small. Does this one get bigger with uh, Awakenings? Because right now it seems... I think it does, right? It does, I hope. I know I've heard some good stuff about him doing some uh, good, plus anti-healing. I, I heard that there's some uh, endgame content that requires anti-healing. I think it's also campaign stage 9, where I have those healers, so he could be a really good one, plus slow. Okay, okay. New legendary. I'm good. I'm good at it. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. One Falsia, right? We want to get Falsia. Back-to-back -back legendaries! I'll take it. I'll take it. Come on. Is this Falsia on this one, or somebody else? Come on, what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh my god, Calypso. Bro, did I pull on the Calypso banner? Did I pull on the Calypso banner by mistake? <laughs> oh, Dacer, if you're watching, I guess I'm I'm starting to understand your pain of keep pulling Calypsos. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, she's only my second one, but I'm, I'm not even one month in. Like, tomorrow's gonna be my 30th day. But I guess, you know what? I'll take a Calypso. I'll eventually get her to A5, and then I can... Find a use for her. <laughs> oh my god. Well, Calypso number two, welcome to the team. You're going to be awakened, so we will take that. Okay, let's skip. Thank you, Calypso. Still, you know what? Back-to-back -back legendary on a guaranteed one that, you know, is going to give me another one at 250. It's not bad. I'm not going to complain about that. That's good. That's good. I already got two, so in another 100, I'm guaranteed to get the third one, which is false, yeah. Let's keep going. Come on. Come on. <laughs> is it going to be another one? No. Okay. It's an epic. I'm like, is it going to be back to back to back? <clears throat> Come on. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? And it is another Vortex. Okay. Vortex is going to get a massive boost. My Vortex will get a massive boost. I'm happy about that. <clears throat> I'm not happy about the rare tax, but it is what it is. We have to get those taxes sometimes, you know. Come on. Let's see. What's it going to be? 
Okay, another epic. What's it gonna be? Another vortex, maybe? <laughs> Come on. Come on. No, Brienne. Okay, I have one, so I guess I think mine's already A1, so I'm just gonna keep uh, awakening her, because why not? <clears throat> okay, the rare tax. We have to get some rare tax. It makes sense. After, you know what? My luck was good so far, so I cannot complain. I guess I do have to pay some taxes as well after the back to back legendary, so I guess uh, let's collect stuff from here. Okay, let me just go and make some space quickly, sell all the other rares. Get ourselves a few more summons. I think that's going to be at least another two temp ups because I was close to it. Yep. Another 50. I might be able to finish it off in this video, right? Let's see. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Imagine if I get another one. Imagine if I get another legendary before the 250. That would be insane, right? That would be insane. Come on. Okay. Oof. Was that... No, that was Brian. I was like, was that four rare taxes back to back? That would have been insane. That would have been... <clears throat> insane let's see uh i guess this one doesn't give me no this one just gives me uh bonus stats uh okay what was the more oh yeah the isotericist okay more stats over there what do i miss oh yeah this one okay i did get a supreme I'm, i don't think i'm gonna pull my supreme ones i'm saving them so let's make i think it's gonna be one more right one more temple let's sell the rares do i get enough i do get enough for another temple come on then I'm gonna be 20 short. That's crazy. That's crazy. Come on. Uh, I'm gonna need three somehow. I, I have to see. I might just finish it off somehow today. Come on. Any luck? Okay, epic. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Another vortex, maybe. <laughs> oh my god. So many. Okay, Edril. That's my A5 Edril. That's my A5 Edril. I cannot complain about that. So uh, I guess what do I need? I need 20 more. You know what? Let me have a. Let me have a quick look, see, see how I can get another uh, 13 more, then we're gonna continue with the video. Okay, so I did a thing, guys. I did just bought these two ones, it was like 15 bucks. It is what it is. I wanna finish this one today, cause quite sure maybe all of you are waiting for it. I'm waiting for it. 20 more, let's see. Let's see. I get anything else, or it's just gonna be false at the end. Okay, this one's definitely a rare tax, cause, well, it has to happen. And now for the last one. Let's get our falsia, or falsia, or however you say it. And maybe anything else. So no, I think this is the guaranteed one, or do I have a chance to get another one? I don't know. I think it just appears because she's gonna be the last one at the end. Unless I'm crazy lucky. Okay, Devos, there we go. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy. There we go. Falsia, welcome to the team. Welcome to the team. And again, the reason I'm so happy about this Demos is because I was talking yesterday with the missus and I said to her, you know what, should I just A5 my D Demos? And she was like, yes, 100% go for it. But then I thought, you know what, let me wait till I actually do my summons because I might pull one. And lo and behold, I actually got my last Demos, my one, uh, one more Demos. And that means that I'm not going to have to use all five of my... Uh, epic hero crystals because I, I got a copy so that's a good that's a win that's a massive win let me show you what i mean i think i have more okay obviously the game likes to lag from time to time has to happen but what i meant was like i have six now i have six of these so i was gonna use it yesterday but i guess i had a feeling that i said like let me just wait let me just wait till today overall though I'll take it as a win, right? I will take it as a win. I got an A1 for a Calypso. I got myself a new Lassir and I got a Falsia in 250 crystals. Like, how lucky is that? Sometimes you might not even get that during it two times. So I guess my luck continues on this one. My luck continues on this account with the pulls. But anyway, this is going to be it for the video today, guys. As always, if you do enjoy my content, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel to see when I upload next, and I'm going to see you on the next one. Peace, love, take care, everyone. Bye, guys.